I've had back pain for many years, starting back in the late 90s. But herniated disc, stenosis, uh, slip, slip disc, and um, those kinds of various, you know, um, ne neuropathy, neuropathy. So I had a carpal tunnel surgery on my uh, right hand. Any kind of exertion which involves lifting, bending, um, standing for long periods of time create, created a lot of uh, pain. Seven, eight, nine level pain. Uh, the last bout of pain was right after I got back from LA in, in February. And uh, terrible neck pain, and he did an ablation on my uh, C C four C five area up here. So it's hard for me to sit for long periods of time. I go for about four hours, and I have to stretch out. He impacted my ability to work for for long periods of time, or to do any kind of strenuous exercise as I got older, because I I you know I'd walk two three miles, and the pain would get so bad I'd have to go turn around and go back. Uh, had many treatments with many um, healthcare professionals, including uh, pain management doctors at Cedar sinai Medical Center, um, who mostly treated me with drugs, um, some physical therapy, uh, lots of acupuncture, and uh, chiropractic. So I tried to avail myself of all the modalities and, and use what's available, but none of them really seem to work. Uh, since I moved to Santa Fe, my back and neck pain have gotten worse. And uh, I've been under the care of a pain doctor here at uh, St. Vincent's Hospital. And uh, they've done multiple um, procedures, you know, outpatient procedures, uh, including um, uh, injections of various uh, steroids uh, in my SI joint, my lower right hip and lower back, and uh, in my left uh, area of my neck, and even uh, cauterization of nerve, they call it an ablation. Um, all of these things have provided some relief, but uh, all of it wears off. They don't even guarantee more than six months to a year, and then they have to do it again. And I've done yoga, I've done Tai Chi, I've done martial arts. You know, I'm very active. I, I, I love hiking and, and walking um, and outdoors. I've done rock climbing and various things. So, you know, I'm in pretty good shape. I'm very flexible. Uh, I can do all kinds of yoga positions, but it didn't seem to stop the pain. Sometimes it would help uh, alleviate it a little bit, the stretching in the morning those kinds of things. For some reason, the way Adams designed it, it, it works really well. And besides getting rid of a lot of my pain, almost all of it, um, it's uh, kind of opened up a whole area of uh, awareness of um, what's going on inside, you know, that I wasn't kind of conscious of. I wasn't really aware of the feelings and um, it's changed my life in other ways too, like the way I interact with my wife and uh, how I feel during the day, my attitude. But certainly when the pain started going down significantly, mm -hmm. um, so I would think within the first 10 days it started working. Otherwise I wouldn't have kept up with it. I noticed results pretty quickly. I've been doing the same things, but I'm like lifting heavy items. I would always say, oh, I can't lift that. I got a bad back, which was great to get me out of doing things when people asked me to help them move furniture. But it wasn't a lot of fun if I went to the store and had to get a big sack of, of uh, fertilizer or something for the garden. Um, you know, now I'm, I'm not afraid to lift these things. I might have a little bit of pain afterwards, but it goes away pretty quickly. Uh, I just did a bunch of gardening with with a landscaper here, and we were moving things back and forth from Home Depot and all that. And you know, it, it just didn't phase me at all to be lifting and loading up the car and 
unloading it. And today we moved a bunch of furniture. So I was moving books around and, you know, it hurts a little bit while I'm doing it, but it always seems to go away right away instead of lasting for five or six hours or even, even days like it used to. And now that you're able to lift things and so on, what else are you looking forward to doing that you probably said maybe you didn't think you'd be able to do? Well, I, had, I used to do a lot of backpacking and, you know, like going out for two, three nights with a backpack and a tent and all that. And I haven't done that in years because I'm afraid that having a backpack on my back would be too heavy. Uh, even, even 30 pounds might be too heavy for me. And um, now I'm not, I'm not afraid to uh, try that. I'm looking forward to maybe uh, setting something like that up with, with some friends. Oh, that's fantastic. Wow, great. And you kind of interjected when you needed to and offered some good advice. So I, I, I thought it was great. Very easy to work with both of you. Yeah, you guys are great. And I really um, appreciate all the work you've done with me. So thank you so much. So if you had to summarize Zero Pain now, if there was one word that would describe it for you, what would be that word? easy it was easy i mean i had to spend some time you know but uh i think got kitty cats here let my kitties <laughs> Just hi <kidding. laughs> so yeah it it was amazing how uh, effortless it was besides just sitting down and writing at night you know spending the half hour or whatever it was required